Pennsylvania State Police recounted the terrifying moments as a gunman opened fire on a monthly town hall meeting. Investigators say 59-year-old Rockney Newell was armed with a long gun with a scope when he blasted shots through the wall and windows of the Ross Township Municipal Building in Sailorsburg, where there were between 15 and 18 people inside. You're watching the most shocking and informative LRJ TV news. Hello, I'm LRJ from LRJ TV. Uh, let's go. And breaking news into Fox 29, Sky Fox Live in Monroe County, Pennsylvania. This is in the Poconos, the home where the suspected gunman in that town meeting in Sailorsburg. Uh, where that shooting took place last night. Three people died when police say 59-year-old Rockney Newell opened fire at a town hall meeting. This was about 7 o'clock last night. Newell was in a long-standing dispute with the town over his property. Township meeting in the Poconos. It happened last night at the Ross Township Municipal Building on Anchorage Road in Sailorsburg, Monroe County. Three people were killed, and police say this is the man who carried it all out, 59-year-old Rockney Newell. And they believe Newell had been arguing with the township over his property. Action News reporter Catherine Scott is live in Sailorsburg for us with the latest. Catherine. That's right, Matt. Officials say that Rockney Newell and township officials had been in an ongoing dispute with the state of his property, but that issue wasn't on the agenda for that meeting last night. The meeting was going on inside the municipal building, which is still taped off this morning, as you can see, when witnesses say Newell started shooting through the walls and the windows. He continued to advance uh, on the building firing as he as he walked forward. Pennsylvania State Police recounted the terrifying moments as a gunman opened fire on a monthly town hall meeting. Investigators say 59-year-old Rockney Newell was armed with a long gun with a scope when he blasted shots through the wall and windows of the Ross Township Municipal Building in Sailorsburg, where there were between 15 and 18 people inside. Officials say it was around 7:15 when he barged into the meeting and kept on shooting. It was pretty chaotic and hectic. I wasn't there. But uh, the phone conversations I had yeah, in the beginning was very, very hectic. Investigators say Newell returned to his vehicle to retrieve a handgun, went back inside and fired even more shots. Pocono Record reporter Chris Reber was at the meeting and recalled hearing more than 10 shots. Reber says Newell was finally tackled by West End Open Space Commission Executive Director Bernie Cozen and another person. According to Reber, Cozen bear hugged Newell, wrestled the gun away, and Newell was shot by his own gun. Well, they certainly did. It's certainly courageous what they did, and I, you know, they they absolutely would have saved lives. State police executed a search warrant overnight on Newell's home on the 200 block of Flight Road, a short drive from the municipal building. Authorities say Newell was in an ongoing dispute with township officials over his dilapidated property. It is rather disturbing for us. Uh, you read, you see it all over, and here it is in in your hometown. I'm back here live at the municipal building where we have seen some investigators back on the scene. We are starting to learn more about Newell. He was briefly active on at least one anarchist website last year, and authorities do believe he acted alone in the shooting. We are expecting to hear more from officials as the morning progresses. It's sad that this man said he wished he killed more people. Where these communities, they really want to push people out because of how their homes look. And like most cities, they get block grants, and that money is put aside to help those individuals like this guy to get their house fixed and repaired. But in today's society, they want to hold that money for developments, and they don't want to help the taxpayers at all. So my question is, um, was he wrong? Yes, he was wrong. Uh, if you have money for that purpose, it's for that purpose. I'm just saying. I'm LRJ. Rate, comment, and subscribe because you be glad you did. I love you all. Peace.